Why do you need so many candles? Why not build a campfire? This is Sabrina's flame. Its light protects us and guides us soldiers every step. Did you rob a convoy of wax sellers? I make the candles myself. I give them to anyone looking for protection within the flame of courage. So long. Mm -hmm. We also have a new uh, journal entry. The Visionary. I think he is the Visionary. It's a character, potentially. We got a lot of stuff. And uh, I'll just go through. It, oh, yeah, they're not they're not sorted normally. Oh, you can just use the scroll. And, the, yeah, that works. That works well enough. Okay, yeah. It's not a main character. The Visionary. Right there. During my travels... I have seen many pro prophets, preachers of, quote, divine truth, unquote, who frothed and gibbered. Okay, well, that's, that's how that goes. Um, and then we have the third notes. I'll take those and see who he killed this time. I didn't find the first ones. Oh, are they in the table? No. He is a candle maker, isn't he? Maybe. I don't know. I, have, I don't actually know what is involved in candle making. What do we have? Hansolt was furious that I had ruined his spectacle. I was beaten to a pulp. Soon I was stripped of my rank, and those I had thought friends turned from me. I started drinking more than ever and sank into sloth, so I was regularly punished. I spent all my free time in solitude, until one day, as I sat with a bottle of foul spirits, staring at a sizzling candle stub, I understood that it had all happened for a reason. I had a calling. The flicker that Miss Glevizig had lit within me spread over my heart, and it burned with the flame of faith. So he just has PTSD. And, uh, and, and is alcoholic as well. Which is just addiction. So that... I... I mm, those, those do go hand in hand sometimes. So, yeah, it's, uh, that's his, that's his thing. I, I did, I did not find the first notes. Well, that on, I suppose, how he, he found himself in the presence of, of an execution. Although, or actually, executing the execution. Pardon my redundancy. Uh, although, sometimes, no, it was execution because that was burning burning at the pyre it because the it also involved the wheel the wheel is uh or or the rack i think is it's the same purpose they're me more means of torture than means of execution although the, it's it's also the case that they would be tortured to death uh a lot of the time but it, this is in real history obviously not in uh, the witcher in the witcher i don't know it could be anything Maybe they, they kill people by forcing them to listen to, uh, um, what's his name? Dandelion? That's the one. Uh, to Dandelion songs. That's how they execute people here. Aha. Uh -huh. We found something. And it's a dead end. So, save. Actually, it might, no, it is definitely a dead end. Um, and uh, let's see what we, what it is. Oh, it's a jump. Reach the tunnel leading to the Nilfgaard, uh, Nilfgaardian camp. Uh, don't want to do that. Really do not want to do that. Don't want to... Oh, no, wait. Maybe I do. Tunnel leading to... Yeah, I, don't, I just don't want to stealth, please. That would be swell. But I, I will see what there is to see. Because that could be nice. There's a cup. Um... See what I mean about stealth? In your hot smithy, change it, you will. Out of the Into way! Into a sword, oh, a shield, and some ale! Oh, I fell your daughter, <laughs> and hear her well. Bring back! Ah, uh, her flesh, not oh, any old flesh. Will you bring me the... On hay in the barn, she really looks fresh. No matter the stench, the sweat, and the pain. Hammer the steel, and I'll have me game. Oh, I think I'm gonna puke. There's a lot to see here. Hey, run to the harbor, lass. Obviously, but uh, we shan't. We shan't. When we were going around and burning corpses, did I pay attention to this? Not in the burning of the corpses, but rather to this. It is a caravan. In The Witcher 3, they do a really, really cool thing 
I really, really like the way they do it, that in the open world, which is they use these uh, this sort of landmark, really, as a uh, as an anchor point for you to... Oh, there's a caravan there. Who killed the caravan? There's probably monsters around that have killed the caravan. And uh, so they use that quite a lot. And it's really cool. What are you looking for, Surf? Away with you. I... I... Fair, fair enough. Um, it really makes exploration in the first game be, well, intuitive. Even though, even though I do think that there's a little bit too much combat in the first game. Oh, sorry, in the third game. Did I say it first? It's, I'm talking about The Witcher 3. Life can be really strange. I fought the Nilf Guardians a few years back. Now we make camp with the Black Rocks. We should have our sea take an interest in things. Or it will turn out like the mill in Stiltum. The one the smith from Jailmouth took over when he married the miller's widow. There's a fair chance of Henselt and Shillard inviting us to their meeting. Well, we should at least object somehow. To spit at the sight of the black ones. Turn our heads away. Piss on their tents. Just need to watch that we don't make a mistake while drunk. Pragmatism, I suppose. At your greetings, Haggard. At my greetings, Haggard. I clicked too much. Pretty please. <laughs> that was a cool line. <laughs> Pretty please, please leave. Uh, so these ones... Are these Nilfgaardians? Camp followers encampment. Aye, there are. And you don't mind. Hmm. What's so strange about that? Excuse me. The lands have slizzards, drowners. We have trolls. And they don't trouble the locals. What about building bridges? And taking tolls under threat of force? None of that. They sit among the rocks, and who'd go there? As for tolls, the headman tricked them, and they're not collecting any. Huh? He said he won't forbid them from collecting tolls, but not where there's no river. He said they'd do better building a highway to the town. And are they building it? Not a chance. Still waiting for a permit from the capital. Hmm. Actually, getting trolls to build highways, that would be interesting. Bridges are quite expensive, but... Well, well, a witcher. Girls, prim yourselves. How can I help you, Hansel? I wanted to talk. We're no strangers to the art of conversation, but it'll cost you just as much as a good plough. Sounds all right. Ask away, then. What would you like to talk about? Anything interesting going on in the camp? Soldiers are scared shitless, what with this battle approaching. They'd rather drink themselves silly than let us honest whores make some coin. Is that interesting? I doubt it. Not raring to fight, are they? They might have been eager at first. But the longer we sit here, the less lively they become. Fighting's like ploughing. Lust for one, and you lust for the other. I wouldn't mind knowing what you think of Henselt. I'm a madam. What can I know about the king? I seem to remember that madams and innkeepers know everything. He used to come here to plough, to develop a camaraderie with the fighting men like, but that was just a phase. Most likely only ploughs sweet smilling ladies now. Heard of the Virgin of Edern? Hasn't everyone. Any thoughts? Oh yes. A maturing woman like that never been ploughed. Her head's bound to be muddled. We'll have peace when she drops her sword to grab a nice healthy prick instead. A nice healthy prick. Never heard of one. I need to get inside the camp. Unnoticed. That'll cost you more than straight ploughing. Man, that's the all she says. Plow, 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 plow. What would you like to talk about? Plow, 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 plow. Ah, boy. How about some... Dice, because we haven't we haven't done that in a long while. Let's see if this is good. Uh, it it doesn't look to be very good. We got a pair, and uh, she does as well. Her pair is bigger than mine, though. Okay, uh, yeah, it's, it's, it should be fine. Let's just always raise as much as we can, and she's raising as well. Mm, oh. No, it's bad. I lose. 
Okay, let's win instead. Pretty good. Right on the next one. Good. And that's it. That's all, all she, she sang. Uh, people are having trouble finding paths and whatnot. Elsie? Boring. Elsie Boring. That's her name. What do we have in here? Stuff that is mine now. Fair enough. I am... Do they all have names? Mutor. Would you look at that? Uh, mm-hmm. So, I know I don't want to get in through here. Or do I want to get in through here? I think I might want to. Is the key required? As long as it doesn't, you know, force me to stealth. That's that's all I need. But I think this is indeed the other way. And I'm going to need to pay to get in. Which is fine. I don't I don't need the money for anything else. There's monsters. Ooh, what the heck's going on over there? Excuse me. What's that? Oh, it's soldiers fighting rot fiends. Oh, well, they're not gonna like it when when they die. Because they're oh no, these are not these are wraiths. Better than rot fiends, I suppose. Although wraiths can be a royal pain in the ass. In the back. No, oh, my God, can't do anything. My God, I just mashing right click for the power attack. But it didn't do nothing. Yeah, rod fiends are all over. That's a kill, and that's a kill. Oh, there's still another one. Oh. They all die. And they might all die because of the... Greetings? Greetings, indeed. Uh, because of the poison. Amethyst dust. Pretty good. I think I can put this away. Do I need to burn your bodies? Lawrence. I smell a tamari. No, it's the necrophages. That's that's what you smell. His mother comes and tells him the elder and the recruiter are coming for you. He was slaughtering pigs at the time, so he takes a pig's eye and puts it between his buttocks. He does what? Puts a pig's eye in his ass. The elder and the recruiter enter, and the mother says, Son, they've come to take you to war. And he's standing with his back to them, his pants down. He spreads his cheeks and says, I can see that. Did they take him? Not a chance. I don't understand. That Was that supposed to be funny or just a coincidence? Or not coincidence, like a, an anecdote of somebody. Eagle. Greetings. Hello. Damn it. Salutations. <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> the coin says these are pansies, not soldiers. But we'll have to make do with them. We'll put them out front. Let the cavalry run them over. Maybe it'll lose some momentum. <laughs> so, the battle was on. Terrible losses on the left flank. They almost broke our ranks. Their serfs dropped their pikes and ran to the archers' corpses. Did they start looting? Listen, they picked up the bows and shot at the enemy. I tell you, each shot meant a dead man. Ah, those were the serfs from Bywood. Exactly. Poaching is in their blood. Hmm. It's also in their... The, them learning things. Using bows requires a lot of training. Although, poaching doesn't... You don't use a war bow, so you wouldn't be able to actually draw a, <laughs> a war bow, most likely. But like, we, 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 it's video games. Those are not about strength. They're about dexterity. We don't have to be realistic. We just have to... I, I don't know. We got her orders and got busy preparing to leave the village. She comes up to him and says, You've promised to come back, and a soldier never lies to his girl. And did he come back? Bah, after two years, with a few scars, having lost three fingers to an axe, but returned, he did. Then, he sees a tyke crawling on the floor, and a man holding his gal by the tip. Her eyes go wide, and she says, You're back! What the hell kind of soldier are you? Again, I don't get the joke. Either way, we are in Vernon Roach's tent, and we have Vess in here. I'm bored. She's sleeping and bored. 
I have nothing to discuss with you. And he's snoring and telling me that he doesn't have anything to discuss with me, which is fair enough. Oh, I was gonna. Man, I can't. I really can't cast Quen fast enough. Uh, I was gonna say, look at the the other coast, but drowners. Pretty good. There's probably more of them up ahead. There's definitely something up ahead. Is that bread? Who cares enough to bring all these things here? Is that supposed to be like an offering to the dead? Who cares enough to bring all these things here? Hmm. Well, it's a conundrum for Geralt, and he always takes his sword out. My god. There's a paper here, but I can't read it. Oh! Oh, this is, um... Nothing interesting. Well, you're the one that told me to examine that. There's something interesting there, and you don't examine that. Yeah, this is the... about the visionary. Strange horror. And this is would be where uh, Vigus. I don't remember her name. It's it's the the the, the woman the woman who they uh, burned was burned. The wheel is there, very on purpose, and it's it looks like a pyre. We might come here later. What do we have over here? Oh, it's just a dead person. But it's not a normal dead person, is it? No, it is not. Tamirian jackboots, heavy leather trousers, and some money. Okay. Essence of water. It's, it's fine. Hut on the cliff. Just above where we just were. And this keeps going. Cast Ard sign. What? Okay, I'll, I'll go in, in there in a little bit. Let's see if this has anything to do with a visionary. We're not too far away. There's some freaking feathers. <laughs> Is that on purpose? Is this the feather person? Oh, no. The one, you know, that asked for things. It's difficult to, to open. And at least opening and going down is the same action. Oh, it automatically closes. Excuse me. It's just a storage room. Although... Oh. Didn't expect that. I didn't... thought Luke was... was Because the, the, there's the use. The use might be that as well. Let's see what else we have. It's just a storage room, right? I think so. There's some tools. I'll take the tools. I don't know what they're for. They might be useful for something. And some iron ore. I have plenty. Yeah. It's not this. It's this. Oh. Oh, is this a puzzle? Maybe. Hello. Damn. Hmm. Oh, that's definitely not what I want. Okay. Oh, cannot save it this time. The lies this game says. Well, it's not a lie. It's a truth, but I. Uh, it's a truth, but I don't like it. Okay, so that ha has like a little person. Uh, you can, I can, if I just look, you can see immediately. You see that? It's got... It's like a, a person. I don't know what to say. And this has a skull. Oh, am I making... 
Am I making the... A skeleton? Either way, this is easy to brute force. Because there's only three configurations. See? Easy to brute force. I, I, I didn't even brute force it. I don't understand what it was. The head first. And then that. It might have been a password for somewhere else. Or from somewhere else. And we got Mal Malget's notes. It's a new phase from a bygone era. Find someone able to decipher the magic notes. Well, I haven't even looked at them and level up. Nice. Nap Nana Zanpa Zi Udu Ya 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 Gat Exa Nana Zi Udu Zi Gat Zam Zampa Nibi. That seems like a very short sentence for it to be like a, a relevant thing. But it could be another passcode for somewhere else. Oh, this is, uh, yeah, this tr truly is automatic. Just opens. It's, uh, mm -hmm. it's just how it goes. Oh, uh, wait, there was another thing back here that I didn't go into. No, don't descend. Oh, it's descend, not open. Yeah, that one is difficult to trigger. Oh, there it is. Murong. Marisa? And Moira. Huh. Oh, there's another one over here. This is the one that we did. Malget. Oh. Do I need to do the other ones? Let's see. Up, zero, down. Nope. Don't need to do any of that. It's, um... They're, they're lit. I can't unlit them. So we were just supposed to know. Or maybe not supposed to know. Ooh. Verbena. Over there. Maybe not supposed to know. Maybe it's related to something else. Uh, but it was only Malget or whatever that uh, actually had the code. Look! It is Harpies. Take that. Take that indeed. And this. Hmm. Oh, hi. Why are there Harpies back here? I mean, we're... I suppose it's early level enemies. Hmm. Is this where I came from? Because that goes back into the battlefield. This might be the way forward. I'll still explore everything. I know, it's going to be key required, isn't it? Uh, no, it's locked. Uh, oh, we might actually not go there, then, if it doesn't say key required. I thought I thought I heard some, some monsters behind me. That's why I was like, oh, no. No, it's fine. Hmm. Guess I'll never learn. I don't know. Look at this big hon hunk of a person. Very angry at me. And that's because they get no per permits from for the highway making. I mean, I would be pretty upset if I ha wanted to make a highway and they didn't get me a permit. Wow, this Gwen is good against these things. Okay. A lot of ropage. A lot of bondage going on with this particular troll. Uh, we have troll skin, troll tongue, troll trophy. Take all those. And throw things away. They don't matter. Good stuff. And also a dead end. Hmm. So I think that's it. That's all there is to see in this area out here. Let's have a chat with the madame. Excuse me, are you the madame? Who's the madame? That's the madame? I need to get inside the camp, unnoticed. That will cost you more than straight plowing. Plowing, plowing, plowing. Oh. I... 
I don't know how much straight plowing costs. And why would it cost different than homo plowing? What? I, what? That's nowhere near enough. 